Phi Beta Pal community. This week for art, we are going to be making a collaborative spoon film. What this means is that everybody will make their own spooning, as you can see in the picture here. They will make their own spooning. And then next term, when everyone's back at school, we will collect them all and we will make a spoon bill at school. So I thought I should explain how we make a spoonie. A spoonie is made using whatever utensils you can find. You might have a plastic spatula, you might have an old wooden spoon, um, maybe your neighbour or someone has some spare utensils they don't need. You can use whatever you choose or if you have a, one of those little takeaway spoons that's sitting in a cupboard somewhere you can use that too or even a stick from the garden you can use whatever you have available to make your spoonie we call them spoonies they don't always look like spoons and that's okay once you have got your utensil or your thing that you're going to use to make your spoonie you need to decorate it when you're decorating your spoonie you need to make sure you choose materials and ways to decorate it that can survive being out in the weather so it's things that need to be able to get rained on, so I wouldn't use paper. And it's things that need to be able to not blow away. So if you're adding decorations like hair and arms and legs, you need to use a strong glue, like PVA or maybe super tack, whatever you have available, okay? Just not use the, I wouldn't use the normal glue stick just because once it gets wet, things don't really stick well with the glue sticks. So I've got some different images to show you to give you some ideas. You might recognise some of the characters in this picture. I can see a couple. Whereas some people, they've just used some patterns or some just some blocks of colour. Okay, this gives you a bit of information. There are spoonbills everywhere. I know there is one not too far from Bean and Powell. And there is also, there's one not too far from me as well. Um, so here's some more images of some different spoonies and here some different ways we can make them if you don't have crafty pieces you can use your natural materials from outside you might like to do an animal a superhero a princess or a member of your family you might like to do this as an activity during the school holidays where everyone in your family makes a spoonie and that's fantastic. You can put them in your garden if you like and then bring them into school once school starts or you can just keep them safe and we will put them all in our Spoonville because everyone in your family is a member of the Baden Powell family. Here's some more. This is a bit of a different one. Last photo. Oh, look, see they've used some wool to make some hair and they've used lots of fabric and some very strong knots to keep the fabric on their spooning. There's lots of different ways you can make your spooning. When you are done, take a clear photo of it and upload it to the Visual Arts Learning Task on Compass. That way we can hopefully make a digital spoonville so that we can see what our spoonville might look like once we're all back at school. And then remember, keep your spoonie safe. I wanna see a Baden Powell community spoonville sometime in the near future. Thank you.